Welcome, players. We finally made it to the last round of the game. David has just been whooping us. You know, just just climbing with his U bells. Uh, in this one, we've got um, Tempai actually versus the U bell Fiendsmith. And I actually like the new. You actually see the new Tempai card as well. It's really good. Just a really great addition. Doesn't really make or break or change much of the deck at all, but it's still really really cool to see. Um, Jose has been cooking up something spicy, so I'm actually really looking forward to recording some of his games when he builds his spice. Um, you guys look forward to it as well. That's, it's actually really fun and weird how much it works well together. So, um, I will say uh, this is the last round after this uh, feature match, I should say. Um, hopefully we will have some fun stories to tell because our regional is this last weekend. So make sure you like, subscribe. Uh, hopefully we'll be able to show some deck profiles of people who made it. Thanks for much. Thanks so much for watching, guys. If you see something, let us know uh, so we can always improve and make these videos better for you. Thanks. All right. All right. Go block. Absolutely. Let's do this. You might get one. Okay. So, draw, standby, and bang. Yep. Okay. We will. We'll start simple. We'll do open. Already the opening. Okay. Good. That's uh. That's uh. That's the perfect new piece essentially. So you have the opening. If you have. Alrighty, that gives you an extra normal summon. Mm -hmm. so you might already have one. But I think I'll Ash here. Ash, understood. In case you don't have the second one already in hand. I'm going to normal summon Samsara. Mm -hmm. Samsara. Okay. Yep. I really wish Spirit was ulti. Really, really do. Probably the next OTS. <laughs> Spirit effect. Yeah. And then we'll go for Nightmare Pain and we'll set it. Mm -hmm. So you already have the combo. Then we'll activate Pain. Yep. And then Pain effect to Troy and Search. Yep. Really? We'll do spirit effect to special. Anything on resolution. Okay. We'll do swimmer effect to special. Mm -hmm. Yep. And then we'll be destroying the Yubel. Yep. Oh, we'll be. I'll be. Uh, then Yubel effect to special. Yep. Oh no. Oh no. We're gonna All ship right. Robin. Then we'll do Super Merit a special? He's doing the place. Oh, uh, we're doing some stuff. Yama. Yama. Yama getting at the Yama red guy. For a Shivana, yes. Yep. And then red guy, you're gonna pop set the trap. Then we'll do Squirmer Effect to special back the spirit. Mm -hmm. I'll do Shivara Effect. Yep. Targeting the spirit to pop special. Mm -hmm. Spirit effect too special. Yep. This Robin Hood is going to take out the aerial. Then we'll do. Unless this Robin Hood is going to take out the Cinderella. Take one. Uh, for rage. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, when she's special, you get to choose a level four or eight. She becomes in a level. Yeah. Which everyone is dumb because like, well, you're always doing one eight. But the new support that they're coming out. We'll shuffle both back. Yep. Hit the fandom. Yes. 
Now, yeah, I'm thinking I say hit calamity the second you drop it. Nobody wants to play it. Yeah. Uh, the gargoyle will be a set of this. Actually, turn card you control the graveyard. You start from this card. I'm going to send my beast to your... Nope. Okay. Give me your Robert Hood. That's fine. And then he'll take how much? Three. Good. Auxilla's effect. And this card is normal or special. Add a Centurion card. Here you go. Oh, and, yep, I don't know how I'm going to do that. Please not yet. Clear with me one moment. Just remember, at the regional, they'll say, too late. <laughs> oh, because they have to play the left field? Yeah. Um, I'm still, still going to have to. Because there's... I have to get that off the floor regardless. You're going to the regional, right? Yep. Oh, okay. I think it'll be like a fourth regional. Maybe. No. Yeah, fourth. Whenever you play a creature. Might as well remind people, like, <laughs> the small little details. The details matter. Yeah. They'll be like, Judge. You gain a lore. And I'll just be like. And you lose the game just because of that. <laughs> and I'll be like, yeah, now we're playing a street fighter. <laughs> All right. Then we'll do Shavara yep. effect to uh, set. Mm -hmm. Make sure I don't forget that. That's super important. Pretty important card. You free pop. And Graver effect. Oh, you're playing the Pinsmith too. Yep. Yep. You haven't locked yourself into anything, or just fiends, right? Nope, nothing at all. But no your deck, your deck does does it lock into fiends at all, or no? You know what? Actually, off of him, I drew like four cards. Thinking about it, it it locks with some with some with much right there. But I want to make sure because here's here's the issue guy that I'm remembering. Yeah. With with Shavala, can I link the SP with it? Because it's while it's face up, but does it does it prevent me from going into a non thing? No, you can't go even go into IP, SP. That's okay. All right, that is that is an easy fix. So um, I'll still I'll still use it, but I'll just go into a thing instead. Okay. Yep. Okay. I'm glad I called. Whenever a monster ignores, but I can single use it. Oh, is it special? Because I'm drawing so much to go into, though. Um, yeah. Because you still link both the Yama. The Yama gets you the trap, right? Right. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yep. Right. Then you do uh, a graver. Yep. Oh, there's a uh, mess up on my part, but I see where it can be fixed. It's an easy fix. That's true. But technically, a P minor. True. Then I'll do track. Yep. I'm just glad I caught it before it got worse. Oh, good thing I just asked. <laughs> yeah. Because I was like, wait, I don't know, can I sell it? Because I'm like, I don't think I'm locked, but then I had to double check. And then I'll discard the glory, and then glory effect is back. Yeah. Gotcha. Then from there. This one doesn't sell right? I'm almost thinking yellow. During the main phase, if you want to continue trap, I'll switch. I will fluctuate this level, so resolving backwards. I'll do sequence effect to fusion. Yes. I'll fluctuate it a bit. We'll send back the moon and the lore. Yep. Oh. I read this. Yes. And then we'll do Lekoma effect, targeting the engraver to special. Yep. Then we'll do track effect yep. to fuse. 
Do you use all three for the bigger one? Yes. And that's the one that's like in, yes. like a uh, droplets, right? Oh, so Correct. Yeah. That's why it's changing. And then yeah. I'll do. This, this, and then that's it. Uh, that, and then that's uh, it. Okay. Yeah, lack. Let me double check. Because this is yeah, this is trigger. It is not trigger. But lack of does. So lack of effect will shuffle a bit. Right? Yeah, we'll put the probably a gray route. I have another option. You I do not. And then this is vanished. That's not unfilled or a grape. Uh, so shuffle back the engraver yep. to burn for 12. Yeah. Burn for 12. Time of the round. <laughs> and all good there. Then we'll do sequence effect mm -hmm. to equip. Yep. Put that out there for a moment. Sure. That is a. And then from there, I believe that's all that I can do, so I'll give this to you, and then that will end my turn. So you have basically an Omni Negate monster effect, and then this uh, quick effect negate, so you can negate one, two cards, two cards. oh it's linked, link. okay. Well, I'll draw. Yes. Standby. Yes. Main phase. Mm -hmm. Let's play the prosperity game for six. For six. This ruling is very weird. And again. I mean, I mean you, you wanted options. The question is, which one? Ship is looking pretty tasty right now. Gotcha. All right. Three cards in hand. Two cards in hand. Thinking here. Absolutely. I know. Okay. I will end the main. Yeah. Two. And then yeah. targets are It doesn't target, but. Oh, yeah. So, yes. Yeah, so it, it only affects monsters, correct? Yep. Okay. Um, I'll chain a bomb. Yep. Uh, targeting the rage response. Nope. Okay. We'll chain Desiree. Mm -hmm. And then Desiree effect uh, to negate droplets. Uh, yeah, 45. Oh! Oh, you can't even activate it. I used a monster. What do you mean? I used droplets, so. Um, in battle, because I use a monster and a spell, you can't. So, what prevents you? Droplets. Oh, so it's just saying I can't respond? You can't respond with a monster. So, I can't, I can't respond directly to it. Is that directly? Because uh, that's why I, that's why I went, I went for the trap to then respond let me to the trap. Oh, yeah, you're right. In the act which one's to the activation. Mm -hmm. No, no, then you're good. Yeah, let's that's what I was, was like, just in case. So, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. So. Let's, I can't do it. <laughs> I can't do anything. I needed I needed that to go all through. Gotcha. I always have I was I was always curious about how Tempai goes that, against no, you, Bell. Um destroy, uh, I, I don't get to see much destroy. of the Maybe games like and how the interaction yeah, works. I know right. Tempai are no, 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 able to just no, board no, wipe, no, blow no, up make well, monsters and just kill and like otk and and, and win but with with you yeah. bell just being oh i have pain any monster you summon you're taking it instead of me it's just so interesting like and i will say every single not every single i shouldn't say every single but most of the tempi games that i've watched i've seen people where they kind of go oh you summon two of the tempi dragons like, yeah i'm gonna scoop before we you know keep going like don't worry about it i already know you can kill me it's like oh yeah like you sometimes forget like oh yeah they can do things they can blow up boards they can they can you know make um i like the big monsters and just swing but you don't really get to see a lot of it it's all during the battle phase i know david has has 
said this before, like, oh, Tempies are so easy now. <laughs> and I hope Jose can prove him wrong. If not in this game, maybe in the later ones. So, um, but yeah, it's just, you can only interact with them during the battle phase. So, uh, kudos to uh, David. Like, I haven't seen the whole, you can't respond with monster effects. I'm not, I'm responding to my own trap. Like, I have not I seen that really since people were running like Hot Red Archfiend. I think that was the synchro. Uh, when people would activate Dark Ruler no more, and then Hot Red's just like, oh, I'll chain my trap and then chain Hot Red to negate Dark Ruler no more. <laughs> so it was actually been a minute since I've seen something like that. So pretty interesting as well to just look out for. So if you do have Droplet and they have a back row, you might want to, you know, monster spell or if you have a trap, like just in general, so that way they can't respond with anything. So um, very curious to see what would have happened in that game. I I'm sure by just swinging over everything, you know, as they do. But um, I will say, hopefully, I, I'm, I don't know which version of the deck, if David's going to change it up for the regional or if Jose is going to change his up and take the pile. I believe Jose is going to the regional. But I hope it catches them all by surprise. That's the fun thing that I like about new sets and new changes in the meta. You have the opportunity or the chance to actually win and top because... They don't know. A lot of players don't know what the new stuff does or where to interact with it. So the chances of you going like, yep, now I'm doing all these, you know, Fiendsmith lines. Like, oh, okay, great. Like, I don't know what to do. Yep, so easy win, you know. And it's it's tough for, like, some players, like me <laughs> specifically, to sit there and be like, I don't know what this crap does. Does it lock you in anything? Does it stop, like... Does it, does it prevent you from playing something else? So if you're kind of a newer player, knowing the rules and the decks that are coming out are really important if you would like to win at a competitive level. I mean, playing the game for fun is always just the goal. But if you want to win and compete at a competitive level, learn the cards, learn the deck, and then you can eventually go to an event and be like, I know what my cards do, you don't know what they do, I have the advantage, I'm going to win, I'm going to get an invite. But, you know, just some obvious advice. Otherwise, uh, enjoy the next game here. Hopefully Jose can uh, <laughs> heat wave and win. First or second? I'll go second. Okay. Oh, yeah, we're, we're done right now. We got plenty of time. All right, so and you might just win this. <laughs> we shall see. So, draw standby main. Yep. Uh, we'll start strong here. Nightmare Throne. What does that do? Adds uh, board choice, a uh, fiend type monster with zero attack and defense. Okay, but not an activation, right? Correct, yeah, it, it is on activation. Oh, it is on activation. Yes. Okay, then I'll ask. Yes. Gotcha. So, then I'm going to do, because I'm lucky I put this into the deck, I'm going to do one for one. One for one? Yeah, yeah, I have nothing else. Do it proper. I got nothing else. I'm sorry. I'll do some sorry effect. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're the wrong monster. Oh, I was like, I'll do some spirit there and a spirit effect to add or set. That's fine. Rebellion? Yeah. Sure. Now we'll set the pain. So now we have the full utility of it. We'll activate pain. Yeah. And pain effect to pop and search. Yeah. Uh, we'll add Stormer. Stormer is super. Uh, we'll probably get a super in the OTS. Yeah, I think this one it was already in the uh, OTS, but maybe I'm wrong. Uh, we'll do spirit effect, chain link one, and throne chain link two. Mm -hmm. Air gold and and then add and then special. Yeah. And then we'll grab the U Bell. Should be there. All right. Then from there. We're gonna do double spirit. Mm -hmm. Two 
Because I want to pop something, but popping it right now won't get me anything. We'll do Swimmer Effect Special. Mm -hmm. No destruction. Yeah, it won't matter. Both of them are in eventually. And then Rekki of Click to the new special. Yeah. Okay. Special Rekki. Rekki of Effect to a Click. I will wait off for the Rekki of Click. What does this one do? Yeah. Okay. Then we'll do a graver effect. Mm -hmm. We'll put back the record to a special. Yep. For the sister do uh, any uh, spell trap or monster effect that attempts to special summon a monster, he can negate it. Once per chain. Is, uh, is it once per chain? And you have the detach? Yes, yeah, so a detach one. Okay. And it's not once per chain, it's just whatever it happens to. Uh, then. Okay. And then one more thing to do. Then we'll do Squirmer Effect. Banishing to summon back the Udell. Yep. I'm going to set one card face down. I'm going to go in face here. Mm -hmm. I'm going to do Sims already Lotus Effect to special. Yep. And then I'll do a Udell Effect to tribute the Terry Carnet mm -hmm. to keep her on fire. Okay. And then I'll give to you to cut. And your turn. Draw. Standby. Yes. Main phase. Yes, yes. I'll activate terraforming. Terraforming is good. I will summon this. Do you want to change anything? No, you could. Oh, that's saying in summoning? Mm -hmm. Oh, that could be saying in summoning? Yes. Effect of saying in summoning? And that adds a one to half, right? Yep. Uh, that one I will match. Okay. I just got the one. And this is only for a face up card type control, right? 
fire dragon monsters you control. Okay. That won't be on the field, right? Correct. Yep. Only on field. Thinking here. Mm -hmm. okay. One card? No cards in hand. Oh, one, just one face down. Face down. I have to attack you, Bells, right? Yep, I have to attack you, Bells, first. Yeah. Either of them. Normal summon. Okay. Attempt to enter battle phase. Understood. Attack into you, Bell. That's good. Damage set. Mm -hmm. Effect of Chandra. Okay. Hydra effect. And then that search is correct? Yep. It's still during the damage set, so. Yeah, it, yeah. Goes through. I don't take any damage. Oh, yeah, no damage uh, because of uh, Second Summoner? No, of Hydra. I don't take any battle damage. Oh, okay. Yep. Well, that's nifty. Mm -hmm. And that's only for effects, right? Uh, any and all effects, spell trap or monster. Spell blue. That includes an effect that specials. Activate Saint Timon. Okay. So now here's where, where I'm interested uh, because I don't know if I can negate that. Because it includes an effect that specials. But I, guess I cannot play them in any sequence. Right. Uh, if I want to activate it. Yeah, so it's not like a mandatory, like you're, you're doing Yeah. It. So I guess the question is, is which, are, which, which effect are you activating first? I'll be activating the add to hand. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah. And then it's two separate effects, correct? Yeah, it's two separate effects. Okay. First, first effect is good. I think, yeah, because it'll be in sequence, right? Yep. So it'll do the one to add, and then the the, the attempt to special. Then I can if I choose to special, yeah, yeah, then I can interact with that one. Mm -hmm. So yeah, first part's good. I'll add again, Ruku. Then attempt to normal su uh, special summon Dora. Okay. And then uh, Caesar will then negate that. All right. Uh, just negate it. it negates and destroys. <laughs> yep, negate and destroy that one. So negate this and destroy. Yes. Correct. Because it's summoning off of the spell card mm -hmm. effect by itself. Yeah. On resolution? Yes. Effect of Genruku. Okay. Since it's what's added to the hand. And then we'll do Samsara effect. We will tribute to turn it into destroy one U Bell on field. Yep. I'll chain Pydra synchro. And I'll train Phantom to turn it into a destroy one end and deck. And then I'll chain Chandra. And then and Chandra to special, right? Yep. And then Caesar. I'll do Caesar to negate that. You grew up with the one and oh, can I just can I just read Caesar? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, just summon some monsters. So a synchro summon would include that, yeah. Yeah. So, resolving in reverse order, unless you have a response. No, yeah, that, that, that's, it. <laughs> that's it. And with hard work and perseverance, David wins the whole thing. He's lucky he wasn't playing against me, because I probably would have picked up his deck and chucked it across the wall. That it's so frustrating. I think I played against Daniel's Ubel as well, and uh, watching some of the other games, like Tayton's game, I. Definitely want to run evenly. I evenly drop it is officially my favorite combo right now. It's just so funny to, to watch. I watched it at, at Nats that live stream. 
Um, I, I love seeing it just, okay, evenly, chain droplets. Like, oh, God. <laughs> yep, pick one card, please. <laughs> it's so good. Uh, anyway, thanks so much for watching, guys. I hope you learned something, and if we missed something, let us know. It really would help us out. I read a lot of the Fiendsmith. As far as I can tell, it doesn't lock you anything. It doesn't stop you from doing anything. So if there's some other lines that we missed, let us know, or an interaction we could have done. Um, hopefully, I'll have some stories to tell about the regional and how people did, and uh, maybe some deck profiles. That would be so fun. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a good one. See you next week.